I'm not drinking no more of this soda. This shit is disgusting. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm probably gonna wrap it up after this one. I'll be back tomorrow, 7 p.m. Central. You already know what it is. I'm gonna, I wanna just make something high, pro, high quality. Yes, it's still here. The same fucking bar, I shit you not. Yeah, okay, buddy. I'll see you later. Great fucking job today. Ugly All ass, the way to the relax. Top. Yeah, I fly in tomorrow. I'll see you then. I'm not okay. drinking it at all. <laughs> a shot of tequila and a glass of your finest whiskey to chase it with. We need to celebrate. Coming right up. In fact, pour yourself some of the same. Well, that's mighty kind of you. A little uh, early to be drinking? No, it's never too early to celebrate. <laughs> well, you must be happy if you're buying random bartender's drink. I sure am. Last night, I proposed to the hottest... My little sister needs to shut up. She said yes. And then this morning, I sealed the deal of a lifetime. Express elevator all the way to the top, baby! Up top. Congratulations! That nigga almost Thank looked you, like Jack Black. Mmm. Oh, shit. Oh, I haven't been in here for years. I have some great fucking memories of this place. Bro, I could already tell this loud nigga right here. This loud nigga finna get on my nerves. I can feel it. I know this nigga finna do some shit to get on my nerves. In fact, ten years ago, to the day, I made my first deal at that table over there. Yeah? He finna do some dumb shit. Feels like a lifetime ago. I always wondered if that shotgun was just for show. Shit, keep playing. You gonna find out. Looking at <laughs> mostly. That's a good one. Should get one of those. Just make sure this guy doesn't get his hands on it. Bro, leave that nigga alone, bro. He not bothering you. He just thugging solo and over there drinking, bro. Dickhead. What's this deal anyway? He's been here open and close the last three days. Just sits there. Doesn't say anything. Let him do him. He thugging. Well, we can't have that. This is a day for celebrating. Hey, buddy. Here, get him a fucking tequila. Have another drink on me. There we go. That nigga spilling it on the counter and shit? Whoa. I he took that hook to the head and kept it pushing. To drink from a man, you, you clink his glass. Shut up. Oh. Oh, I'm... I'm sorry. I'm, I'm not really in a celebrating mood. I've, I've had a tough couple of months. Yeah, well, so did I. Oh, but through hard work and determination, I turned it all around. Well, no amount of hard work can turn this around. Damn, negative. Nothing can make it better. Dad. I bet you it can. You don't understand. It's all out of my control. Let's make a deal. You tell me your problem. If I can fix it, you celebrate with me. If not, fuck, I'll pay for your drinks for a week. Scout's on it. Fine. That nigga finna come but up I on a free week conditions. of drinks. I tell you at your own peril. I take zero responsibility, you understand? It's intriguing. Ooh. Then you buy me the drink first. All right. A uh, whiskey. Get bitty ass whiskey bottle. I don't drink for real, so I wouldn't know. Your turn. I just be talking. Damn, he took took it to the head. Yeah, yeah. I came up with a genuinely original idea. Okay, okay. And I'm the only one who's immune to it. Well, that doesn't sound too bad. Right, right. Immune. Yes, immune. What are you talking My about? My wife was the first victim. Hello. Whoa. What's up? Good morning. His wife ugly as hell. I'm not going to sit here and act. Have you seen my pen? My favorite one. You know the one that's got the blue and the red and the black and the, and the thing? It's not going to be in the knife drawer. You look tired. 
What time did you get to sleep? Decent time. I was asleep. And I woke up from this blast of light behind my eyes, you know? And then it was like a million and one migraines hit me all at the same time for like 10 seconds. And then there was like this pressure inside my skull, like my, like my, like, like my brain was trying to push right through my head. And at the end of it, I had the most incredible idea. What? Well, what is it? Huh? What's your idea, Mr. Incredible? So well, she's really ugly. She's like a totem pole. So help me God, I told her. What happened after you told her, nigga? She looked really concerned. That's the idea. Michelle. So simple. What's so simple? I'm so. Oh my God, that there was mind blowing. Bro, her hair long as shit, no cap. Well, I don't believe any of it. Someone's head exploding for no reason would have been on the news or something. It was on the news, but the CIA suppressed it. Oh, the old CIA angle. Yes, the old CIA angle. Turns out they actually do it in real life. <laughs> okay, I'll bite. What happened next? The police. I phoned them as soon as my brain started working again, and they took me down to the precinct they started interrogating me of course at this point they all think i'm a wife killer and i i can't blame them what autopsy report came back okay looks like what you said was true they couldn't find any evidence of physical force so i can go home it'll be a while before we can get a detailed report but in the meantime we need to figure out what's going on here I mean, your wife's still dead, and you still have her blood all over you. Damn. Well, I need you to tell me, word for word, second by second, what happened in that kitchen. Well, I was in shock. You know, I didn't have time to think it through, so... Come on, Barry. Talk to me, Barry! Boy! my idea. I'm starting to not want to hear this nigga idea. I thought this was my darkest moment. I'm cuffed to a steel bed, crying like a baby. My wife is dead. My life is ruined. What, bro? Turns out Rock Bottom was still a ways off. <laughs> Tell the bar she'll secret them hoes will just explode. You can walk out. That is until the CIA got involved. Damn. Nigga, what? Mr. Moore, this is Agent Grove, CIA. Please tell the woman across from you your idea. I'm sorry? The woman across from you. Please tell her your idea. The one you told your wife. I, I don't understand. Why, why, why do I have to tell her the idea? It's part of the investigation. I believe you are innocent of your wife's death. To prove it, I need you to comply. I... What? I told her. Guess what happened? After that, they kept bringing people in. Prisoners, psychiatrists, scientists. Tell him the idea. Tell him. Tell him the idea. Damn, they doing this nigga dirty. You will comply if you ever want to get out of here. I'm not telling him the idea. 
He he real, he real. He not telling nobody to kill niggas. He is going through it. How is any of this even possible? I don't know how, but I got a theory as to why. Because of your idea. No, because of my original idea. You see, every idea that hangs around happens because of other ideas. You take two or more, you combine them together, add a bit of spice, trim it down, whammo, you got a new idea, right? Okay? Mm -hmm. This is different. Completely original. Now, my okay. theory is human beings can't handle an original idea because they have nothing to compare it against. The brain goes into an infinite loop cycle, trying to find some place to slot it in, and pfft. Okay, what bits okay. of brain in my beard? Brits of braid. That nigga, <laughs> he said brain. I'm slow. That's a crazy story. Have another drink on me. She Very entertaining. Snared. Well, I'm glad my messed up life entertains you. It would be heartbreaking if any of it were true. Okay, you know, don't even go there. What? You want to hear the idea? Well, of course I do. I mean, you can't tell a story like that without piquing interest. No, this is exactly why I told you I accept zero responsibility for telling you my story. Okay, fine. Ah, let, let, let's just say that I believe all of this. How did you get here? To this Nigga, bar? you walked in there. No okay, bro, hold on. He walked into the bar and started bothering him. Bro literally shows up to the bar every day and do nothing but sit there. Like the nigga said, how you gonna come into the bar, start talking about all this money and shit you got, and then start bothering this nigga who was just chilling before you even came in? Like, what, bro? Yeah, will let you out of their sight. No, they did. No, they, they told me, to do, do, don't, don't travel, don't leave town until we clear you. And then they implanted me with a tracking device. <laughs> but I'd have told that nigga the secret. Like, fuck you, lame-ass nigga. tracking device! Now I know you're lying. Like, there's no way that they would let something this powerful. Be like, hey, bro, bartender, come here. I'm gonna tell this nigga the secret. But I am not a liar. I know a bluff when I see it. And I don't mind being. Thank you for that look, Cully. Means a lot, you bro. You need to be able to deliver something. Next time, you gotta tell a story that's a little more believable. Everything I told you is the truth. I mean, you are lying. I'm just trying to figure out what the scam is. There's no scam. You asked me what was wrong. I told you, you wouldn't cook up a story like this for a couple of drinks. You need to be angling for a bigger payoff, like a couple of dollars towards a new life. There is no scam, okay? Look, look, hey, look, look. See this? This is the last thing I have of my wife in the entire world. I couldn't even go to the funeral. You know, her family said that they would kill me if they ever saw me again. Oh, so that's your wife now. A photo of some random woman is supposed to convince me that all of this is Oh, this is so hating ass nigga, bro. That's my wife. I am not a liar. Hey, 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 hey. hey look, just relax, you guys, all right? Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Fuck this whole extra cool ass nigga, bro. Tell that nigga your idea, bro. Fuck that nigga life up. I'm gonna find out. Bro, hey, bartender, cover your ass. You just got engaged. Go home to your wife. Enjoy your life. I'm feeling lucky today. Let's hear it. Okay. Unless you want to come clean. Fine, I'll tell you. Bartender, I suggest you plug your ears and have a mop handy. This is gonna get messy. Did I say eyes? I meant ears if I said eyes. I'm feeling lucky too. Oh, bartender, you finna get fucked up too, my nigga. Okay, well, bring the whiskey over. I don't wanna have to reach behind the bar after. Quit stalling. This one's on me. Just in case. There you go. No more women. Well, I tried to warn you. Here's my idea.
Wait, 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 wait. What that nigga say? Hold on, hold on. Well, I tried to warn you. Here's my idea. What the fuck? Why oh, this nigga dodges and uh, covers him? It's so simple. It will change everything. Every everything can be better. You're immune. Holy shit! You're immune, bro. That's what I. Was that's what I'm saying. That nigga like Jack Black. Bro, that soda is nasty, bro. Pop. What the fuck? This changes everything. Okay, we need to come up with a plan. No, fuck it. Pass me the tequila. Oh, ho, ho. we need to celebrate. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Mm. Okay. What is this nigga doing? You're immune. That must mean other people are immune too. Okay, we need to figure out what makes someone able to handle the idea. Okay, well, I know what we gotta do. You know what we gotta do? We gotta analyze everything that happened here today, come up with a theory, we'll tell some people, hopefully they survive, and then we can spread the idea. How can you stand it? What? Wonderful idea of being able to share it or the person will die. How could you, in good conscience, tell it to me? Hey, hey, hey. You're the one who dragged it out of me. Exactly, you fucking dickhead. You ruined my life because of your ego? You ruined your own life, you, you fucking dweeb. You couldn't just take the high road and laugh it off? A man is dead because of you. Your Look, fault. He made his choice, just like you did. Look, you're gonna shoot me? Shoot me. Yeah, fuck is you wait no. I suggest you put your moaning and help me figure this out. Got him, stupid. Shoot him, do it. Yeah, you too pussy. Put the gun down. Okay. Now, I know it's gonna take you a while to come to grips with this, okay? But we don't have the luxury of waiting. We need to figure this out before the CIA finds out about you. No! That nigga is stupid. Hey, you pushed his top off. That's crazy. No, nah, no, nah, ain't no poor guy. No, that dumbass nigga brought it on himself. Hell no. Nah. Dumbass nigga brought... What the fuck is she doing? Dumbass nigga brought it on himself. Dude was literally minding his own fucking business at the... Oh, okay, 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 okay. I'm about to say, fuck that. Fuck this lame... Hold on. Fuck this, this lame-ass nigga right here. He brought it on himself. We don't have the luxury of waiting. We need to figure this out before the CIA finds out about you. No! Dummy. That nigga is a dummy indeed. That's crazy, bro. Nah. Fuck. <laughs> yeah, nah. That hoe was fire though. Yeah, they got 1.7 M's. Okay. Nah. Yeah, fuck that dude. That's what he get. His his fault. 